what's good? Thank you for tuning in. Yo, this morning I had a couple technical difficulties, some weird blank spots, some weird ear rupturing like static sounds. I don't know what's going on, but I did do my dunk subscriber review. So that started up again. I know you guys have been waiting for that to come back. So I do go over that, but that also took a lot more effort to edit. My screen recording slows on my computer so much. So I don't know what the hell, but I'm going to try to work on it. I'm a one man show. We're always making progress. We're always making that energy. We're always getting better. We're always improving. I hope you have a great day and I hope you enjoy. Let's go! TikTok helps me teleport. Teleport. TikTok is super cool. My god, TikTok is wild, wild. TikTok, TikTok, tick. TikTok, TikTok, tick. Tiggy tock, TikTok, tick. TikTok, TikTok, tick, tick. Tick, tick, tick. Wild. Oh my god, dog. Yeah, Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh my god. Wild, wild. TikTok is super cool. Dog, yeah, i From wherever we go when we sleep, it's the morning, it's the day, it's the day of today, and today's the best daily, baby. That's what we do. We dunk on life. Max out your life, max out your charged. I've seen all these memes about charged spirits. It's, we charge our phones 100%, but we don't charge our spirits. We don't charge our energies. So charge your friggin' mindfulness. I read this book yesterday. And I say read the whole book or this weekend, I mean, how to sit. It was like really short. It was on meditation. It was beautiful. Super quick read. Just go to your nearest bookstore, pick it up and read it in one sitting. It took me like 30 minutes and it was really good. If you never meditated, that was a really good book. Makes me want to meditate every day. I try to do it before I go to sleep. What's going on? This is what we do. We have energy and we go for it and we do it and we maximize our life. Today, I want to go over, uh, I have the winner from the dunk re review and there's another winner that I'm going to do next video or whenever I want to do it because this is what I do and whatever I want. Um, but before that hit the notification bell and someone will smack you in the back of the head, but it won't hurt. It'll just jog your memory and you'll, you'll remember something that you totally forgot from childhood. That'll change the course of your future. So you're welcome, but that's only if you hit the bell right now. <laughs> and if you're already subscribed, dude, you already have that memory, but it'll just come to you naturally. So that's the benefits of just being subscribed and notified, <laughs> subscribed and notified. Um, yeah, so thanks. And, uh, yeah, I'm doing my open mic tonight. What, what, what else did I want to mention real quick? So I'm going to do my dunk review and then the other competition and then I might open another competition. I'm going to keep the competition going so every time I have a video to do, I have, I'm have i ready because that's what I learned from the first time of doing uh, subs reviews is that I always was ready to do it and then I forgot to get the videos from the people because they didn't even know they won yet so then I forgot, yeah. So I'm trying to get that way in advance. So if you won, congrats. And if you didn't win, um, uh, you can uh, enter again. And I'm also going to pick a winner from yesterday's podcast of the comments. If you comment the Dunk Life, you get a free book or a free program, whichever one you choose. So that's pretty dope, if, I think, because it's, I think, as if I was you and I was watching, I would think it's so dope if someone gave me that. Cool. Um, open mic tonight. Super pumped about it. Going to yell at people, going to dance, and I'm not going to tell any jokes. I'm just going to see if I can make them laugh with pure energy. I'm kidding. I have jokes too, but I'm finally doing it. It's 100% today because I was on the bump list, meaning I signed up the first week. And when you don't get to go, you're, uh, uh, when you sign up, you get guaranteed for the next week. But then the freaking hurricane, Storm Dorian. Storm and, Dorian. And then, <laughs> and then uh, this week I got confirmed. So I'm super pumped. It's tonight. I'm going to record it. It's going to be fun and I'm um, terrified, but at the same time, I'm super excited. I think I'm more excited than terrified. The only thing I'm terrified is if I'm going to be terrified, which is very weird because I'm like, I think I should be. Um, but then if I don't give an F, which I don't, I think about having fun. Like if it was just all people, if they're, if they're enjoying it, I'm not nervous at all, but it's just like, will I be able to get in the right mindset? That's what, that's the weirdest part for me is like, I want to get in the right mindset. And it's hard, but like right now I have so much energy. I feel like I would go up there and just go nuts and there's no way I don't have just like ideas flowing, but some parts of the day I don't have those ideas. I just feel like getting stuff done. That's what I've noticed about me. Sometimes I have to be more action. Like, uh, I don't even know, just get things done, done, done. Sometimes it's creative. Like my mind is just like, um, 
if you're watching the video, you're just listening. My hands are going outwards. Like they're just like jumping all over the place, all these different places. But sometimes I'm like zeroed in on something only for a short period of time, but I don't have those creative ideas flowing like a freaking waterfall right now. They're like waterfall coming in and I just have like genius flowing through me. I'm working on raps. I'm working on more videos for this. I'm loving the podcast. I actually dunked yesterday on 10 feet, just kept it light. I'm strengthening my hamstring now with hamstring curls and trying to do single leg too. And it hurts a little bit, but I'm pushing the pain a little bit because you got to push it a little bit to test it. And it's actually not getting worse. It's actually getting a tiny bit better. Like it always feels like it's a little bit inflamed when I do it. Not, not during it, but like a little bit after just like I just ran it. But then as, as I like cool down, it gets better. So it feels really good from the strength training. I'm going to try to get my hamstrings and my low back crazy strong. So the fact that I did those good mornings on that machine that you saw on my Instagram, um, that gave me a crazy low back pump. I'm like, man, it was super weak. All those imbalances I've said before that causes the inflexibility and the injury prone injuries. And that's it. And that's what I, uh, let's get to the video of, uh, of the person who won shout out to Jalen Kirk. I believe his name is. And, um, if you want your video reviewed, hopefully you win. If not, I offer it on my website. Um, and I do that. And then if you want to keep up with me and more of my training more closely, my Instagram is like more daily, more up to date, but what's up. And if you want to follow, if you want more entertainment in your life and you really want to laugh and you really want to enjoy your life to the fullest, cause this is the only way TikTok. TikTok's the only way because it's so much fun. And I went hard yesterday. I made a masterpiece. I made an effing TikTok masterpiece. You saw it at the beginning of this video, which I'm thinking about now because I'm going to put it at the beginning because it'd be a great way to intro this. Dude, TikTok is my life. (laughs) It's so much fun. Okay. So now let's get this going. And here we go. So this is Jalen Kirk. I think he did a one foot dunk and a two foot dunk. He is 6'2", I believe. Let's see what he said. I believe he said that. Let's see. So, yeah, he entered. He won. Congrats to you. And let's get the video going. I can't find it, but here's the video. Ooh, two-foot dunk. He asked for a little technique on his two-foot dunk. Let me get this out of the way. Okay, looks really good. I'm going to back it up here. So, very nice dunk. I don't know how high the rim is, but I think he's just practicing. But technique looks good the way he has a big penultimate. But then right here, you see he, he, great positioning with his chest upright, his head upright, and like he's behind his plants. I just think he can use even a little bit more of an arm swing because he kind of just like brought the ball up, really drive that ball up. And then also, I use a lot of speed, so you can try to push your speed a little bit to even jump more. Um, and then his two feet, they kind of planted a little slow. Like you can speed that up too. Like they planted one, then the other. You can go like super fast. You can see it can be even faster. If you compare this to my video, you'll see the differences. But everybody's a different style jumper. But I do think people can go a lot faster. And when you push yourself, it makes you jump harder. And the last thing is even a bigger penultimate. You can get a bigger penultimate right here and extend like extend that foot way out, get even lower, and just really explode. Basically, a jumping dude is really tough. It's just like sprinting. If you wanted to sprint, there's a lot of technique in jumping, so it's a little different than sprinting, obviously, but when you're sprinting and you're trying to go 100%, you're trying to shave off a fraction of a second, you got to just push yourself as hard as you can. You can't just like work on technique, technique, and you run faster. Yes, it will help, but if your technique is perfect or whatever, you have to push yourself. So I would say for you, technique looks really good. Just really explode. You might even want to use like a heavy ball and, and do medicine ball throws to get that upper body so strong. And I also like lobs. Throw, throw yourself some lobs and that are really high and go get them. Try to take off them further, all that stuff. And now let's watch the other one. Ooh, why is the freaking thing in the way? Let's see. Ooh, okay. So that one even, that one looks a little bit more explosive. So you see the way you brought the ball up, how it, that's a really good tip for one foot is that you bring it to your off side, to your left side if you're a right-hander and you swing it across your body. That's like the ultimate way to get the arm swing. You did that really well. Knee drive was really straight up. I'd say your one foot technique, your timing is perfect. I think it looks really good. It looks a little more natural. It looks like you've been doing that a little bit more. And if so, comment below and you could say that I'm a friggin' sensei master. Okay. Um, so yeah, congrats to Jalen Kirk. Good work. If you want your video reviewed, hopefully you win. And if not, I do it on my website. If you really want like a full depth and analysis to help your journey, cause I know that's helpful. Um, it's only like 10 bucks or something like that. Oh, where'd it go? One more time. Yammed it boy. Let's go. I don't know why there's no sound, but all right, here we go. So this is from last video. Why anyone can dunk, by the way, 
If you haven't seen this video, I believe anyone can dunk and it's also just a motivational video, but I think anyone can dunk and should because of all the benefits that comes from it and what you learn about yourself physically and mentally. So yeah, there's that. There's that. Uh, okay, here we go. Instagram, YouTube, random comment, winner. All right, here we go. The winner, you have to have written dunk life. Uh, let's see. Oh, look, filter comments based on specific text. 12. Well, actually, I'm not going to do that because just in case you didn't do it right. All right, let's see what you got. Sorry for the listeners. The winner is, let's see what he commented. Hopefully it's Dunk Life. And he did. DC Takeoff. Let's go. Free Booker program. Let me know in the comments of this video below what you want. And that's it. And we're going to do On This Day in History real quick because I know you guys freaking love it. On This Day. September 11th, we all know what happened. Two passenger planes hijacked Al-Qaeda terrorists, crashed into New York's World Trade Towers. So never forget, uh, no jokes, but uh, much love to everybody who had anybody who they knew in that attack. Hopefully no more attacks. Hopefully more love is spread and more knowledge is about that we're all humans. Go watch that egg story. Please watch the egg story. It's about the universe and how we're all living lives, every single life. So everybody's everybody. The universe is everything and we're living every life until we become gods. That's what the egg story is about. I'll leave the link below. Enjoy your day. I don't know where this went. I'm super pumped for open mic. And I'm super pumped to keep making these videos. Let me know what you want to see. And I have a lot more to come. I'm excited to keep reviewing your dunks. It's a fun part of the podcast and it's a fun part of helping you guys because it shows me something that I could teach you. And also um, it gives me good something to get hype about. So give me some yams. Let's go. You don't have to dunk either. You don't have to be able to dunk. You can just be touching the rim and I'll help you out. Let's go. Have a good one. Toodaloo. Always hoping that one day I'll need a name.